Now time for us to review and practice a bit. Remember that we use demonstratives to show where an object, event, or person is in relation to the speaker. Have a look at the sentence below and fill in the gaps using the appropriate demonstratives. This is Mary and these are my parents, John and Anne. Also, remember that demonstratives are placed before the noun or the adjective that modifies the noun. Have a look at the sentence over here. Fill in the gap using the appropriate demonstrative. Can you see that red car over there? I think I've seen it somewhere else before. Note that we can place demonstratives before a number by itself when the noun is understood from context. Have a look at the sentence over here and find the noun that can be understood from context and then replace it with a number. Note to use demonstratives before a number. These earrings aren't as nice as those earrings. These two aren't as nice as those two. Also note that demonstratives can't be used by themselves when the noun they modify is understood from context. Have a look at the sentence below and find the noun that the demonstrative modifies and that can be understood from context. The gossip about Pam has nothing to do with me. This has nothing to do with me. Note that when talking about events, the near demonstratives are often used to refer to the present, while the far demonstratives are often used to refer to the past. Have a look at the sentence over here and fill in the gap using the appropriate demonstrative. This job was a waste of time. I didn't get any experience. 